Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the REC Podcast, brought to you by the REC Toycast. I'm your host, Roman Chavez, and with me as always... Eric Icarus. Eric. You can find us on Instagram, (laughs) at REC Podcast. You can follow myself, at Roman REC Podcast. And you can follow our handsome devil here, at... Gulag underscore J underscore Wilden. There it is. At the Instagram. Uh, Yeah, at the Instagram dot com, uh, (laughs) HTTP... Dot www, you know, that, that, that whole chestnut. Backslash. That whole te- chestnut. Well, let the vacation begin, Eric. <laughs> let the vacation begin. Uh, Eric and I work in service industries and entertainment industries, and uh, we are, like many of you out there, uh, facing with, uh, you know, this 30-day coronavirus ban. Um, so we feel your pain. Um, I'd like to say we're, we're going to try to put out some more content, so at least you have something uh to listen to uh whilst yep. you drown your your sorrows yeah. like like I shall be um I've got a I've got a nice uh bottle of margarita that I'll <laughs> that I'll be imbibing uh every, every chance I get I guess and uh you know yeah. guys we're all in this together okay you know those of you who still have your jobs we hate you and so on but uh hey just uh everybody be safe out there um if you've got you know local small businesses that you can support those of you that are still working whether they be restaurants or heck even comic book stores i've already seen some dire things on uh <clears throat> online right. about some um comic book stores already having to shut down which is like they must have already been on their way out because right. we're like if you can't 13 hours. Yeah, yeah, we're like thir- and like we're like 13 hours into this whole thing <laughs> and like nope, we're not going to make it. Like they're already just just cutting limbs off. So yeah, yeah. um you know, not everybody's as fortunate as 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 some of us. So, you know, do what you can out there. Buy what you need. Try not to Man, it's just everybody be cool. Just yeah, be just, cool. Just chill. Yeah, and uh, watch your watch your Netflix. Listen to listen to some podcasts, especially this one. Yeah, maybe There's I'll, some cool stuff coming down the pipe. Yeah, you know, and maybe maybe I'll watch Contagion. Uh, hey. Make that one of my my fifty two movies. Right for sure, man. Uh, although freaking Disney Plus. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, I have so many issues with Disney Plus. Really? I've had it for like I don't know five weeks now, yeah, right. and I mean, I, I'd say more than half the time I can't get the stuff to play. Huh. Now, I haven't called, sure. you know, or anything like that, but it's uh, – all my other streaming stuff is working. For sure. And so but they've dry. had a lot, of, a lot of more time to get the bugs out. Because I remember when Netflix was kind of doing that same thing when they first started, it was like the streaming was not as uh, – Well, what when, it is today. When, when your job gets cut for 30 days, I need my streaming to work. For sure. Or well, I'm that's gonna, why. Because everyone's a big influx of people uh, not Netflix doing and Hulu's working. Netflix and Hulu's hey, working. That's all I'm saying. Up. So come on, guys. Let, let let's get this thing. Let's get this thing figured out. You know. Yes. Um. Anyway. Uh. uh anything that you're gonna try to watch now that you're gonna have some free time? Oh, you know, I, I I'm gonna have to get on my list and just go for it, man. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you know, I'm gonna try and bang out two, three, four movies in a day. Nice, you know, nice. Try to stay conscious through maybe one of them. Yeah, yeah. I, them. I don't know if I have time. <laughs> I don't yeah. know. I don't know, man. Yeah. Um. Because you know, for me, w- one thing that impacts my movie watching is my ability to get snacks. Oh, and, yeah. and right now, snack time is not as not as abundant as it once was. <laughs> as it was a mere a mere like five days ago, I know, right? ten days ago. Oh you my know? god, we're uh, all gonna starve to death. Oh god, calm down. No calm more down. Snickers, <laughs> Cheetos. <laughs> oh well, I you know I I, I, I murdered somebody for those. It's fine, you, you know. Yeah, I got my stockpile. Um, I'm gonna try to. Uh, you should watch Supernatural. Yes, I need to get on that. You yeah, should watch Supernatural. I, been getting on me. Uh, we made a deal where she'd watch Daredevil. Uh huh. And I'd watch Supernatural. So uh, I, I believe I got more seasons to watch. <laughs> yes, yes. Uh, you know, just like a couple more. You know, yeah. Shout out to Roberta. She is. Uh, uh, I believe she already started her Daredevil binge. Uh, binge. Yes. So, so, so that's off to you. Yeah, you, you got time, man. You got time now. All right. Um, you know, maybe we can have it on in the background here. We can do some things. Yeah, yeah. We're not gonna be able to do anything if we have it on. I'm gonna be like, dude, watch this. Hey, this is gonna be the dude, best. Yeah, yeah. This what, the best what, right here. Yeah. Yeah, you uh, you're you're in for a treat though. That that's a that's a good way to. And if you can do 15 seasons in a month, I mean, hey. I'm sure you get some type of trophy. Maybe I hope so. You know, maybe a cake at least. I yeah. want some cake. Yeah, if you can do all 15 seasons in a month, I will yeah, have a quart of ice cream. Yeah, Christine will make you a cake. All yeah. right. Yeah. And then all the Ben and Jerry's I can. Yeah, can take okay. which isn't much because well, actually, you put hey. you put ice cream away like like a champ, <laughs> like you're like you're working out, uh, you're getting ready for some type of strongman competition when it's the exact opposite. <laughs> um, on the news front, yes, 
Uh, well, you know, I, I don't know what I'm going to watch. Actually, I, yeah. I do have tons of movies that I Maybe. should I should be watching, but uh, uh, you know, it just depends on if Disney Plus is working. All 52 movies I'm going to watch are going to be Disney movies. Really? And hopefully, Sons of the South. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, guys. Just kidding. So- Song of the South. So- oh, is it Song Song, Song of the South? Ah, uh, I don't think that is it on there. No, no, they'll never release it. I mean, not, it's not, not that even, bad. It's pretty bad. No, it's not. It's no. it's pretty blackface. Okay, I mean, a little bit. <laughs> no, a lot of it. <laughs> I don't think you remember Song of the South. Remember when we watched it in high school or in yes, middle school? Middle school. Yes. Yeah. Um, and like, it felt weird then. It kind you know? of did. Yeah. Yeah. Zippity doo dah. Yeah. Jeez. Zippity a. Um, yeah, well, I, I'm sure I'll find some things to watch or get some work done at the house, you know? Sure. I'm sure Mrs. REC Podcast would enjoy that. <laughs> um, but I gotta say, you know, at least there's a little bit of news, even though the entertainment world is down. We still have tons of rumors to discuss. Right. And, uh, two of the most delicious, I would mm-hmm. say. Um, I guess they're both, they're both equally big if they are true. Uh, there's rumors going around that the Deadpool... Um, continuity will be erased, that we're going to disregard Deadpools 1 and 2, and that Marvel Studios will go ahead with their own version of Deadpool with Ryan Reynolds. Um, I mean, but it's one of those characters where they can easily just yeah. make fun of it, yeah. explain it away. You know, it's it's such a, it's such a wacky character and act wacky perspective. I mean, why not? Yeah, I, I, I think that that would they be... just make a quick nod to it, and yeah. then... Yeah, just with the show. Just have like Ryan Reynolds like address us, you yeah, know, yeah. <laughs> in the in the smoking jacket, you know, in front of the uh, 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 campfire, and yeah, it's like, hey guys, it's a whole logistical thing. Yeah, um, they'd love to love to keep what was going on, but like, you know, he was Thanos and he was Cable. Yeah, like, how's it's that gonna, gonna work? yeah, it's just you know, it's gonna be a little weird, <laughs> and like kind of jab at him and how they kind of sound the same, you sure, know, like. Sure. Uh, it, 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 they could lean into it. They could lean into it and have a really good time, and it would and it would fit. Yeah. It would fit oh, the brand. Time. Yeah, absolutely. So I, I, hopefully they have the balls to do something like right. that. But but yeah. we'll see. Um, and I mean, it's not like fortunately they didn't establish like a strong line of continuity in those two no, films. No, no, you know, no. they spoilers, kids. They killed all of X Force, and I know they then went back and retconned it. But to what end? Yeah, you yeah know? for sure. So uh, I can't say that I'm. Uh, um, yeah, I'm not. I'm not married to it. No, I'm not and, either. And I, mean, I want to see a better juggernaut. Yeah, I mean, I, it was cool for what uh, it was, yes. but it was cool. No, not uh, knowing, hey, we're never gonna get this in a you know in sure. a Mar- MCU. It worked for that. Yes. Yeah, but uh, to get a, a legit, say, like get a real established actor to play him, yeah. and be in a bunch of different movies is gonna be awesome. I kind of still want CG though. I think yeah, kind of like still, how they did Thanos. Yeah, yeah, I, I want that yeah, mm-hmm. exactly. But uh, get somebody. I don't even know who. Um, I, yeah. I really did like Vinnie Jones. I did like Vinnie Jones, but but that was so bad. That, it was bad. Although, man, I rewatched the the scene where he's uh, in X three where he's chasing a kitty, uh, kitty yeah, like yeah. through the place, and he actually looks cool. Yes, like he looked like they did a good job oh, of right. like going doing practical mm-hmm. and making it look okay. Yeah, yeah. It, you can't do the big juggernaut, but this this makes some sense. Sure, but man, uh, uh, what's her name that played a uh, uh, kitty? Oh, um, I can't stand Ellen Page. Ellen Page. Yeah. Oh man, I like Ellen I Page. Can't stand her. Um, I, I like Ellen Page, and I was like, man, I, I would, I would, I was so glad when she came back for Days of Future Past. Right, that was kind of. Cool. I was so I glad. It. So I'm, I'm glad they did that. I heard that her her filming on X3 was a nightmare because of uh, Brett Ratner. So oh, I can't imagine. Yeah. Um, because yeah, he's a he's kind of a jerk. Right? He's a jerk and a sleaze, and you know, yeah. Well, we should hang out with this guy. Yeah. <laughs> no, we do not condone such behavior, Eric. All right. <laughs> This is this is a this is a this is a PG thirteen, pretty family friendly podcast. Sure. All right, no, you're right you're we right. do not condone. I don't like Brett Red. I hope he dies. Yeah, but that being said, R- Red. Dies. Oh Jesus! Nobody young is getting it. And then watch tomorrow. It'll be out on the news. And like, oh, Brett Ratner dies. <laughs> he was beaten to death with a Corona <laughs> bottle. <laughs> Uh, 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 anyway, we digress. Yes. Anyway, back on um, page. What was she? Um, no, she was just great as that character. Mm-hmm. I, I, but like, they never. She was just there. Yes. You know, and like, I think she did a lot with a little. Yeah. And uh, I think I think I would if they brought her back like 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 my dream you know mm-hmm. of them doing kind of an astonishing X Men thing oh, nice. like hey this is already established we're just gonna try to work this in it's it would never work because we need exposition to mm-hmm. we need to, the sure. ride but man. To get that version of uh, of Kitty Pride, right. like that age, like what what Ellen Page is now, right. like coming Perfect. back, yes, 
It would be perfect. Yes. But I would. That, I think that's what we discussed on one of our very first podcasts. Is like uh, if they were to, you know, this is before Disney acquired. Yeah. Uh, X Men. That we would want them to take the Astonishing X-Men oh, yeah. with it and yeah. have Joss maybe as a consultant or mm-hmm. the director yeah. slash writer, yeah. which that would be perfect world. But it's not a perfect world. No, so. no. As, as we can tell by, by toilet paper fights. <laughs> that's how you flex on somebody right now, right? You just like TP somebody's house. Really? You know? Just yeah. Show them like that's what Dig you it. got. That's yeah. what you get. Yeah. <laughs> um, but kind of the more interesting is that they're, they're talking about that it's happened or that it's very close to a Marvel uh, Marvel Studios, Sony, uh, New Deal for Spider-Man. Oh, cool. Okay. Like an extension, like a further extension. Oh, I already thought they worked that out. They worked it out just to do one more Spider-Man movie uh, to finish the trilogy and then uh, another Avengers appearance. Okay. So that was what they... So that, that last year when they had, we had that, that freak out for like 40 getting, days, Yeah. what they worked on was like, okay, we'll do a third Spider-Man and this... And then they were hoping to work out something else. Again, this is not confirmed uh, because maybe maybe we don't want people uh, excited about entertainment news right now. But it is <laughs> both of these rumors are just kind of swirling out there in the in the ether a bit. And I mean anything to get everybody's mind off of something right now sure. too, you know. So oh yeah. hey guys, did you hear that this might be a a thing that's going right, on? Right. Like yeah, they're they're talking again. You know, <laughs> the, the, the the two sides are talking. So. Um, that's kind of cool, though. I mean, um, I, I did hear a rumor that Sony would offer to sell Spider Man for ten billion dollars to to uh, to Marvel. Jesus, and why not? But they just did acquire a bunch of stuff yeah. for too much. Yeah, I mean, they they just spent eighty something billion dollars yeah, so on Fox. It's kind of like, come on, guys. Yeah. So it, I mean, yeah. I, I mean, I hope they do work it out. I mean, I want more Tom Holland Spider Man in the MCU. Yes. Oh yeah. Know? And um, I think and Tom Holland wants it, you know. Yeah, I think so, he does too. Uh, 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 John Watts uh, tweeted or uh, posted on IG, uh, "Spider Man work from home," like talking about <laughs> like coronavirus, and it showed Pete, and he's like on the computer telling everybody to stay safe. I thought that was great. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Boss logic. I sent. Uh, yes, I got that. that? You, yeah, I, 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 in a perfect world. Yeah, again, again. Bo- Boss logic made a Spider Man three poster, and like the three is like the DD for Daredevil. And you know we've talked about that as well. Like, oh my gosh, I we we want Daredevil to show, or at least just Matt Murdock to show yeah, up as, Char- as a lawyer. Just Charlie Cox, yeah. you know, just a quick like, oh yeah, you're screwed. Yeah, you're because it fits. Prison. Yeah, it fits. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm not that good of a lawyer. Yeah, really uh, yeah you know, <laughs> spoilers, yeah. kids. Yeah. He's, he's uh, kind of not on the show. It's like the first season they did it pretty good. Yeah, and then that Punisher season, he's kind of like uh, in and out as uh, a lawyer. Yeah. So they want to do too much. Yeah, and. uh Gosh, if we could get a uh, Happy Hogan, new Foggy in the yeah, same yeah. room, oh my I would I would just love that. Just that awkward <laughs> moment, you know, just that moment. That'd there. be amazing. Because uh, you forget, yes. you know, people yeah. forget that. Oh, yeah. that uh, yeah, we have. Well, she sounds like a Mexican appetizer. Oh yeah, electric nachos. <laughs> I mean, why wouldn't you make that? Why why hasn't that been made yeah, yet? Yeah, I want electric nachos. Yeah, yeah. I mean, just do something like wild and green. Yeah, um, yeah, anyway. Yeah. Some horseradish. Um, Wait a minute, what? <laughs> 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 some, some saffron. <laughs> We're going to turn this into a cooking podcast real quick, guys. Really, really quick. Um, um, but I don't know, man. I'm scared to not get Deadpool back like R-rated. Yeah. I don't know how they're going to do this. They might not, man. They might PG-13 not. PG thirteen Deadpool is not going to work for me, man. It, I think it would because he really wasn't an R rated character until the movies. I mean, I with not. the exception of the violence. Okay, that, that yeah, yeah right. just the violence. But right. you, we can do a lot of violence in PG thirteen. That's true. And not all the blood has to be the same. Yeah. You know, but you can do a lot of violence in PG thirteen. Uh, I've been a big proponent of that since the beginning, like because I want to see him in there, and then it would be funny. It, it would be great if they could keep him R, and then it would be funny if he's in other people's movies. And he's bleeped. Yeah, he's just bleeped. <laughs> and, like, he notices it. Like, yeah, yeah. whoa, what the... Is this? You yeah. know? Yeah. That'd be, like, that'd be clever. Yeah. I'd be down with that. Just really lean into the comic book right. world. Exactly. Because they, they, they leaned into it really well in those two movies, but there's still more room. Yes. There's still oh, more big room. Time. Oh, big you know? time, dude. Um, you know, doing... Somebody like John Watts. Like, like yeah. introducing him in a Spider-Man sure. movie. Yeah, yeah. And, you know, really talking about how, you know, Spider-Man's his favorite superhero. Yeah. Like, it's a true thing. Um, one, of, one of my favorite Deadpool and, and, and uh, uh, Spider-Man moments, and I, and I can't remember the entire setup, but Pete ends up getting knocked out, and, uh, and like, Spider-Man needs to do something, so, like, Wade just, like, 
takes his ma- like uh, takes his mask off, puts his mask on him, yeah, and, like yeah. kisses him on the cheek, and then he goes out as Spider Man to do this thing that, that that Pete needed to do. And uh, it was just kind of this fun thing, you know? Just kind of this fun issue. Yeah, the cover uh, drawn uh, very well. I, I can't remember the artist, but yeah. yeah it's just it's just Spider-Man lifting up his, his mask, and it's Wade under there, and he's just, like, making the shush, you know, right, gesture. Right, right. And, uh, yeah, and, and that would be really funny. Like, I would love to see, especially Tom Holland and Ryan Reynolds, and, you know, Ryan Reynolds and Deadpool being like, Man, I just thought you'd be a little older, you know. Right. Like I, like I thought we'd meet and we could go get a beer and we could talk about girls. Right, Have right. you even kissed a girl yet? You know, <laughs> like like stuff like that. But then, like, like Deadpool kind of fanboy out. Yeah, yeah, totally. Like about him too. Like when he I'd sees him. Hard. Yeah, I can totally get on that. Like, th- there's a lot of good comedy for oh, just yeah. comics and fans, and, and, you know, comic book fans. Um, and yeah, it would be. Yeah, it, I would really, really be excited to get like a fresh. But we know that there's a that there's a past, you know. Yeah, but yeah, the, yeah. The, you know, like the other the X Men, like they don't really know what Wade's talking about, right. you know. Like, <laughs> he's like, yeah, you know, the apocalypse thing. Remember James McA? Oh, uh, never mind. Yeah, you know, mind. just stuff yeah. like that. You know, that'd like, be that, that, I, why not do that? Yeah, well, why not? Yeah, why not? Um, you know, I know we've been kind of lingering on the coronavirus, but I mean, it is it's a big deal. It's a big deal. Um, what do you think? This year's movie, like, landscape, landscape. is going to look like now, you know? Because I, I haven't seen the, the official dates released for Mulan and for... Um, I think James Bond is going to be November. Um, so, but, like, Fast and the Furious, from what I read, that they pushed it to next year entirely. Wow. So they must have really wanted that month. I guess. Because they probably don't want the company. That's probably why they make so much money. They always release it in a, a month. That oh, yeah, that's the move. Yeah, that's the move. Like, I would have put it in August. Yeah. That's what I would have put it because yeah. no, no big movies come out in August, no. and just like spread it out a little bit because in November you're gonna have a lot of other things to go against. Yes, you know, yeah. it, you know. So like, I don't know. It they should have moved that to no, uh, uh, James Bond to August or Fast and the Furious to August. I don't think November is good for James Bond. I mean, it's still gonna make money, sure, but I think that the you know you're you're just you're all, everybody's pulling from the same well. Yeah. Um. So you you might say that Fast and the Furious is smart for for going to the next year, <laughs> but there's more big move like this year yes. is a good year to like be like the that, other that, guys yes yeah like sure. you you could you know de- you know wonder woman's gonna be you know top five film yeah I agree. um mulan. black widow is probably yeah. gonna oh, be no, top wait, five the, uh... you know and mulan should be but i don't know when it's gonna come out and are they gonna you know are they just gonna start competing against themselves too much because these other guys who had these other weekends are like oh marvel disney took this weekend and right, right. and so and so took this weekend so we're taking these they're not gonna move out of their weekends no and then they're gonna be like yo we want you know something like uh i'm trying to think of something that's that, that, that i'm not super uh ghostbusters i, sure. I want to see ghostbusters yeah, yeah, but, but it's go- not. yeah Ghostbusters. And, and if you're black widow you're not gonna try to come out against ghostbusters you know like yeah it, it's gonna this year is just gonna be such a wash yes. year for oh, many yeah. things a lot of stuff and yeah you know the yeah we're gonna i'm gonna buy a bunch of uh movie theater stocks because they are in the tank right now oh really oh yeah because they'll be on the rise again though. they will they will yeah uh, amc stock was at like two bucks the other day a oh, share wow. but they're on the verge of the 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 company that owns them i believe out of china is like been trying to sell them off oh really so uh yeah they're 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 not long for this world in this current form um, but other, other places, you know, it's like next year's going to be big for movies. Oh yeah. But man, you cannot see this stuff coming though. No. I mean, this came out of, this came, came out, out of nowhere. nowhere. Came out from the far east. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> if, if we're to believe everything, yes. Yes. You know, it's, <laughs> do you see how Trump keeps calling it the Chinese coronavirus? Oh, no. Yeah. He, he keeps saying it that way. Really, really trying to hit that home. Really trying to hit that home. So it's the most ridiculous. So thing. he's not just saying coronavirus. Yeah, yeah. He keeps saying the Chinese coronavirus. <laughs> like, dude, it's Man. absolutely ridiculous. This guy's, this guy's a this guy's a maniac. Yeah, we're not too political on this no, show, guys. Not, but not. I just thought that that was funny. This guy's a wild man. Yeah. <laughs> wild card. <laughs> I just can't help but think about like just what you know. The entertainment landscape is just it's destroyed right now. Yeah, yeah. Big time. They, they've even stopped recording. Like there are some shows that were like TV shows that were going to be finishing their last couple episodes. Right. 
They're, they've stopped production. Yeah, like Winter Soldier and, and Winter, Falcon. Winter Soldier, you know, because they were in Prague. Yeah. Um, I, I listened to uh, uh, the Fighter and the Kid podcast with, with Brian Callen and uh, Brendan Schaub, and Callen's in the show Schooled. They had one episode left to film. Yeah, couldn't do it. And they stopped. Dang. They stopped. And it's... You know, so I was thinking, I was like, oh, hey, you know, w- when they started pushing movies out before these before these right. bans started happening, yeah. these decrees from governors and whatnot, <laughs> um, I was like, oh, man, Netflix is just going to, Netflix and who, they're just going to start buying up stuff because they could produce it and da 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 Right. And I was like, oh, we're going to have at least stuff to watch. Sure. But, man, I mean, you get 50 people. You can't, so 50 people make a show easily. Yes. So you just can't have that many people in the same spot, oh, man. man. Like, yeah, it's. I'm glad that I had been so behind on television and Maybe movies. This is because yeah, I will in a have weird way. This I will have the opportunity to catch up on a lot of stuff. Bro. Yes. Oh yeah. Um, I mean, you finally catch up on your agents of Shield. I have not, but I will uh, most likely. Yeah. I don't know. I, I do feel like it's a good opportune time for me to finish up in the. You at least make a bigger dent in the studio slash toy room. I mean, I think we can get this done. Yeah. I mean, I people are wanting to see see what's see what's coming down the pipe for us, and you know we can use this as a positive. Yeah. You know, yeah. it's all bad right now, but let's try and spin it. Yeah. Oh let's, yeah. Let's try and get on video this month. Yeah, I'm gonna get some. I'm gonna get some. Uh... You know, we'll be eating some cans of beans. Yeah, you know, <laughs> yeah. like a bunker down yeah. here. <laughs> the yeah. wreck bunk. Yeah, it took it took a it took a weird turn, guys. Yeah, yeah. I uh, like it. All of the entry points are bottled up with uh, toilet paper and bottles of water. <laughs> <laughs> Just plugged it up. Just plugged it all up. I mean, have you uh, seen anything crazy out there yet? Um, I've seen people shoving. I've seen some shoving and some shouting. Yeah, yeah. Um, I, uh, I I've definitely seen a, um, my fair share of name calling. Oh, uh, yeah. I yeah. can't I can't say it on the show. Yeah. Uh, but let's just say the uh, the B word was used. Oh, oh, the B word. The B B B word. My my word. My word. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, some shoving. Yeah. And uh, you know, a little choking. Oh wow. <laughs> yeah. Wow. And uh, what are we talking about again? <laughs> and I, I I felt bad because I couldn't get to my camera in time, my oh, camera yeah. phone, because it got broken up too fast. Oh, man. Yeah. You know, it's like World Star. While it's fun. You know, people are world star haters too. Man, they they they, they get their uh, they get their licks in and they go. Yeah, exactly. You know? It's like you, you before you realize what's happening, like, it's Ugh. it's done. Yeah, yeah. it's done. <laughs> you know, no, nobody fights like they used to. They okay? don't, man. <laughs> they, they're just not as tough as they used to be. Yeah. <laughs> Were you once tough? Right? <laughs> I was. Yeah. All right, kids. That's our show for today. Just a quick one from the RAC yeah, guys. Just let you know we're still alive. Yeah, and, uh, yeah. We're and we're probably going to be pumping out some more stuff, guys. Yeah. We we want to give That's you guys some, some entertainment. We're bored too. Um, I still got a couple more days of work left. So does so does our, our man alive. Icarus. So you know we're, we're not in full on uh, panic, uh, mode, panic yet. mode yet. You know I'm still technically getting a paycheck, which is nice. Um, but for those of you out there who are not, we uh, we're with we, you. We're with you. Well, in a couple weeks we'll be with you, but. Uh, you know, again, stay strong. Yeah, stay, yeah. Uh, stay, yeah we're, we need to get a, one of those yellow bands for coronavirus. The stay strong. Oh yeah, is that what live, it's live strong. Yeah, exactly. It's some type of ball cancer. I, I can't remember. Oh, lying yeah, ball cancer. yeah, lying ball cancer. That's what it was. <laughs> let's lie, let's end on the lying ball cancer note. Let's do it. That has been our show, guys. If you like what we're doing, please hit the subscribe button. Leave, give us a like. Leave us a comment. What are you guys doing? What are you going to try to watch during this during this quarantine? You know, what are, what are you going to try? What are they calling it? Self distancing. Yeah. Yeah. Social distancing. Social distancing. That's what it is. What are you going to do? What are you going to catch up on? Even if it's not TV, maybe you got a project. Like we want to hear about it. If anybody leaves a comment or something cool, um, we'll talk about it on the show. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Totally. Um, yeah. Let's see. What else? What else? Eric, you got any final thoughts for us today? We did not do final thoughts last show. That no, we didn't, fault. man. Well, there was a lot of thoughts going around that show, dude. <laughs> yeah, there was. There was. Uh, I think, uh, yeah, everyone just needs to, to be on the grind, man. Mm-hmm. If you can't work, then do something constructive. Yeah. Uh, stay calm and create. Yeah. That's all Re- we can do. Read a book. Read some comics. If you haven't read a comic before, this is a good time. If you've got a couple bucks, go spend it somewhere. If, if, if you're fine and you can go get some takeout, Go get some takeout, man. You yeah. know, put put these people to work because if you don't go, if we don't go get stuff, they're gonna they're gonna shut it down completely. And if you want an orange Julius, <laughs> get yourself an orange Julius. Ah, uh, that is my show. Of cancer. Thank you guys so much for listening. I've been your host, Roman Chavez. I'm still Eric Icarus, and we'll catch you, man, probably real soon. Real, real, real soon. soon, real soon, guys.